in the Quran and we've always thing you should not be shy of I said this it is one thing to add struggle to try and read the Quran correctly make an effort strive to read the Quran correctly some people are too shy to add the melody in the Quran and we've always said this it is one thing you should not be shy of it is the word of Allah do it with the correct heart and you know what practice at home do it in your own even when you're sitting on your own don't just read the Quran Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen Ar Rahman Ar Rahim Maliki Yawmiddin you want to be achieving greater spirituality from it read it melodiously when you're on your own that's what we're talking about May Allah make it easy for us. Allahu Akbar. It is actually an act of worship to beautify the recitation of the Quran and to read it correctly, to make an effort, spend money to join courses that will teach you how to read it correctly. One might argue, okay, you're not allowed to charge when you're teaching the Quran. That, that's a, inshallah, that's differences of opinion we're not going to speak about today. But the reality is, at least make an effort. There are free lessons, wallahi, free lessons in your masajid and around you. Sometimes we don't even know that the masjid down the road that I lived next to, for example, for 12 years, there was a top reciter that used to teach people. And I lived right down the road and I never ever went there. After I left the country and returned to my homeland, I found out, hey, the top readers at that masjid, I lived right next door. Big deal. You lived right next door. You didn't benefit at all. Why? You were hardly ever at salah. May Allah forgive us.